Oh, good. A concussion. Should I start recording here? Okay, so I'm put, gonna put the mouse off screen this time. Hello, my lovely jubblies, and welcome back to Undertale. Um, let's keep playing. I don't know what to put else here, but uh, let's go talk with Mama. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate. Oh, okay, so. Alright, I didn't save after I went to sleep. I have another surprise for you. Yay! I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> oh, it's a fireplace. And this way. What's over this way? It's a kitchen. Oh, butterscotch cinnamon pie. Should I steal it? Should I? What, what happens? Um. What a nice smell. Too hot to eat, though. Dang it. Oh, I thought I was just gonna devour it while it's still hot. I can eat fire. I'm an independent kid. Oh, it sounds dead. The spooky, spooky basement. Ooh. Oh! Hey, do not go down here. I have something to show you upstairs. Oh, fine. <laughs> this is it. A room of you, whatever. I hope you like it. Okay, okay, sweet. Petting the head. She's gonna be evil. I like it how it also moves the hair a bit. Is something burning? Alright. Whatever's Trevor's. Alright, so we got the room and the disco light. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's go to bed. I think that's how you progress the storyline. But hang on, how could something be burning? She took the pie out of the oven. What? You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Cinnamon. Alright. Last time, I watched the video and I noticed that there was a window on this renovated room, so what happens when- Oh, it's a mirror. <laughs> oh my, I wasn't expecting that. It's you! Yay! I wasn't expecting a mirror of all things. I thought it was like a vision way path into the world of uncertainty and evil. <laughs> Hey look, the me in the mirror is looking into the room. What do you see, Mini-Me? I see death. Okay. Mini-Me, Mirror-Me. What do you see, Mirror-Me? Aw, oh, she's reading a book with glasses. She's like your nanny. Hello, nanny. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still... I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, and did you want something? What is it? When Can I go home? What? This... this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? She's evil. It's called 70 use, 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Sure. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails make terrible shoelaces? Wow. Did you know that snails make terrible shoelaces? <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> well, bother me if you need anything else. She's evil. She's the one that pushed me. I am here because of her. Uh, she doesn't want me to leave. I'm trapped. I'm trapped. I could just leave the house as well. The size of the pie in <laughs> intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Oh. Well, to be fair, it is like the size of my head. And I've got a pretty big head. Like, wow, look at my head. It's so huge. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier, and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked, until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named Home. Okay. As great as our king is, he's pretty lousy at names. <laughs> That's a funny history book. Uh, okay. Okay. So... 
will she catch me again since she's reading a book going down into the basement? Dun 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 dun. Hovering. I don't make any footsteps. She won't be able to see me. Dang it. I think you should play upstairs instead. She's magic. She has telepathy. What happens if I leave? Ooh. Last time I read the diary, it had a joke in it. No, that's not that's not her room. I want her room. It's Toriel's diary. Read the encircled passage. Yes. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely! Alright. Joke just in the caliber. Uh, okay. Wait. Is that because she's preparing for my arrival? <laughs> Toriel Small Chair. It's na the name is Cheriel. Okay. You peek inside. Scandalous. It's Toriel Sock Draw. Right. Socks. Okay. Doesn't seem to be anything too evil here. Usually if I'm rummaging around in someone's house, I find something that is beyond evil. That's what happens. Look, go outside. I'll just save again. Seeing such a cute, tidy house of the ruins gives you determination. Yay! Okay. She doesn't seem to... She knows why I'm going into the basement, but not when I'm leaving. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, another froggit. Hello, froggit. Ribbit, ribbit. Just between you and me, I saw Toriel come out here just a little while ago. She was camering some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to her to talk to her. Ribbit. Oh, is she evil? She's evil. She's the one that tripped me. Oh, a dagger! You found the toy knife. Yay! And what's this Taj Mahal thing? Is it a castle in the background? Can I go there? Do I have how much how much of the monies do I have? Sixty-one monies. Alright, I'm just gonna ask Toriel how to exit the ruins because she seems to be hiding that fact and I didn't want to upset her before, but now I kinda of do because I want to progress the game story in order to get something in the 30 minutes I'm gonna play this. What is it? How to exit the ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. I didn't listen last time you said that. It's not gonna work this time either. She went down to the basement. I know it. I call it. She tripped me. She's the one that's killing. She's evil. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the ends of the ruins. A one way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No, Toriel, no, you cannot, you cannot do this. She's evil, she's the one that pushed me, she tripped me, she... Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. No. <laughs> I'm an independent kid. I don't get told what to do by adults. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. She's gonna attack me. She's evil. She's the one that tripped me. Dun 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 dun. You want to leave so badly? <laughs> You're just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Dun dun dun. Toriel walks the way. Couldn't think of any conversation topics. No. Wow. Oh, she uses fire. Victoria looks through you. You try to think of something to say again, but nothing. There's a magical attack. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution in the situation. No shit! Shit. I guess I have to fight then. Oh well, shit. That's not gonna work. The 
toy knife. You equip the toy knife. Good. Oh shit. That's right. She uses her mittens. I dodged that. Looks through you. She's unfocused. She doesn't want to do it. What happens if I flee? Escapes. <laughs> Literally escapes. Fine. You have bested me in my own game. Well, it's not technically my game, but you know. It's close enough. Is that the sounds of the exit being destroyed? Maybe she just can't do it because she's, I don't know. Well, if that's the case, then this game gets thrown to a standstill. Look at me being an obedient little child. Alright. Steez, please, <laughs> wake up. You are the future of humans and monsters. <sighs> I've been awoken by some mystical thing saying, Steez, please. Oh, let me guess. Is Toriel reading another book? No, she's probably out there still destroying something. Am I still low on HP? Alright, so I don't seem to have any problems with life or anything like that. So if I go back into the tunnels... Already? What will it take for you to learn your lesson? Not destroying the door, possibly. Toriel blocks the way. Uh. Okay, 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 okay. So if I. Uh, not fight, act. Check. Attack 80! Holy crap! Okay. There's a magical attack. Talking doesn't work, but I'm just going to keep doing it because I'm a stubborn, independent kid. Dang it. She looks through me. Well, let's... I want to see what happens when I get one of the red ones. 16. Okay. Out. Oh, whoops. That was weird. But... She attacks me, the ruthless thing. Acting aloof. Alright, so if I eat the pie. Maxed out. Oh, okay, that did absolutely nothing. I thought it was gonna be like dredging up some memories or something. Okay, okay, let's let's. Nothing. I've been told not to fight. It wouldn't work anyway. She said she said it twice this time, we're getting somewhere! said absolutely nothing twice this time. Three times! Okay! Maybe we can get it to five times. Oh, she's got a lesser attack. Oh, but it still bounces. It takes a deep breath. Question mark. Good. He's acting aloof. Acting! What are you doing? I'm not fighting, just like you told me to. Attack or run away? No! I'm an independent kid. <laughs> I'll die if I want to. What are you proving this way? I'm proving that I can dodge your attacks with my little heart thing. Can I sneak around her Metal Gear Solid style? It's not gonna work, is it? Stop it. Whoa, shit. Oh. Oh, crate. Crate. Ah, crate. <laughs> that was... That was horrifying. Um... There we go. I'm starting to affect her. Stop looking at me like that. Go away! Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to the situation. Oh, that's why it's ironic, because she told me to talk when, when I was instead of fighting. Okay, so she's gone back to saying dot 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 once, but she's looking away now. That's, that's one thing. 
Oh, oh, she's proud her eyebrows. Things are getting intense. She's attacking away now. Takes a deep breath. I know you want to go home, but... Dot, dot, dot. But please, go upstairs now. I promise I'll take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. We humans, we're stubborn, independent kids. <laughs> dot, 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 rousing conversation. No, I understand. Here, the ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I'll put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Aw, she hugs me. That's cute. But I don't hug her back. Okay. Goodbye, my child. Maybe my arms are just stuck to my sides. I want to turn around and face her. Okay. She looked back, but I didn't. Now it's my time to look back and maybe regret the choices I've made. But then re my <laughs> Maybe regret the choices I've made, but then realize that I'm an independent kid and I'm gonna die if I want to, so goodbye. <laughs> uh, I feel a little bit of regret. Not too much regret, just a bit. Slightly regret. Oh, getting lighter. Even lighter? More light! Oh, I was expecting a forecast of even brighter. Instead, I got a door. Oh, it's that flower! How dare he! The one that tripped me. He's the evil. He's the one that wants it, anyway. Clever. Very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So, you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you met a relentless killer? You'll die and you'll die and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it? I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't... Ahem! <clears throat> Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much more interesting. I'm narrating the character. It's just using dots, so... Shut up. <laughs> you got the fan going in the background? Yeah, it's, it's background music. It is evil. It is evil. Oh. Oh, so not fighting? Yay, he's evil. He's not evil. He's the one that picked me up. I don't know. To another door. back to the start, are we? Oh, is that it? It can't possibly be it. Oh, I know, maybe that's just the prologue. Yeah, that was the prologue. Yay, I'm free now. Oh. Question mark? There's a camera, hi camera hidden in the bushes. Oh, security camera? Are they spying on me? The person behind the camera is the evil. He's the one that pushed me. He's the one that went reason I'm here. Maybe it's the cannibal spiders. Maybe. I don't know. More woods. More cracks. Ooh, spooky tree. Oh, you can see through it slightly. And a stick. It's a tough looking branch. It's too heavy to pick up. Oh. Sad face. Ooh, who was that? Is that the warehouse from Tog? Never mind. More trees. The spooky trees seem to be increasing in frequency. Oh, what's that? Just a figure of my imagination or something? Oh, spooky. Okay, I watched it that time. It wasn't anything there. Spooky trees. 
spooky bridge with a spooky archway over it, with spooky pylons that don't even reach the bottom. Oh, that's that's un that's unstable. Uh, I can hear it. Uh, he's evil. He's the one that pushed me. He's the one. I'm, he's gonna push me again. Uh, I'm gonna fall. Oh no! Oh no! Human, don't you know how to greet a new pal? Will you talk a bit faster? Turn around and shake my hand. That was really slow. I can't, my hands are- oh, there he is. <laughs> the old wolf is cushion in the hand trip. It's always funny. Wait, no, isn't he sound like- It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the Skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. <laughs> Quick, behind that dimensionally shaped lamp. <laughs> it looks exactly like me. It's a sprite that's exactly like the character. It's beautiful. I'm not controlling this bit. <laughs> Sup, bro? You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp is really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. It could be like, would it be like this, or would it be like, yeah, say yeah. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. I like that one better. Then I, the great papyrus, will get all the things utterly deserve. Oh, well, I thought that was an exclamation mark. <laughs> I will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard! <laughs> People will ask to be my friend! I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning! Hmm, maybe this lamp will help you. Sans! You are not helping, you lazy bones! All you do is sit in bodong- boon boondoggle. Boondoggle, that's a word now. All you do is sit in boondoggle! Boondoggle, that doesn't make sense. You get lazier and lazier every day! Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. Look, I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. Evidence. <laughs> Sans! Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it! Your skull, you can't move the smiling. Uh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're already working, really working yourself. Down to the bone. Hey! Ugh! I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> okay, you can come out now. <laughs> I just love it how it's perfectly styled to me. It's beautiful. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. I'll be... this. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. I assume that Sans and Papyrus are gonna have very fun dynamics later on. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you just might make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. You're a fake. I can't stand up behind it. I want to stand up. Just a conveniently shaped lamp. <laughs> it's, it's beautiful. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. <laughs> oh, it does, doesn't it? Um, use the box? I'll read the sign first. 
This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Yay! Uh, my friend told me that... Ooh, a tough glove. Yeah, that this thing will come in useful later on. I kind of guessed why that would be, but... I'll just put it in the box for now. Uh -oh. A snow drake flutters forth. Uh, what can... He's got chainsaw teeth. Okay. Uh... Uh... Check. Snowdrake, attack 2, defense 2. This teen comedian flights to keep a captive audience. Flights to keep a captive... Better not snowflake out, dude! Alright, dude! Snowdrake is smiling at his own bad joke. Laugh. You laugh at Snowdrake's pond. See? Haha! <laughs> Dad was wrong! Oh, whoa! Snowdrake is pleased with this cool joke. Uh, I'll, I'll... No, I can spare him now, so I think I will. You won! You earned 0 XP and 12 gold. That's a lot of gold. Ooh, a fishing pole! Is that an enemy? It's a fishing rod fixed to the ground. Reel it in? Yeah! Well, that's attached to his end of a photo of a weird-looking monster. Call me! Here's my number. You decide not to call. Oh, I want to see the photo. You send the line back out. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Rail it in? Yes. Uh, still the photo. Alright. You decide not to call. Okay. He's gone fishing for likes. Oh, 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 it's papyrus! <laughs> so, so, as I was saying about uh, uh, Undyne. So, as I was saying about Undyne. <laughs> They're doing a dance. <laughs> what the shit? What is going on? <laughs> Sans! Oh my god, is that a human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh! Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! It's... Is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undyne will... I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular! 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 Ahem. A human, you shall not pass this area! I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you! I will then capture you! You will be delivered to the capital! Then... Then... I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> there we go. Well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep in mind. I'll keep an eye so I get out for you. <laughs> what are they doing? The 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 oh, that's what happens. Ice cap struts into view. Compliment. You inform Icecap that it has a great hat. Duh, who doesn't know? Whoa! Okay. It's snowing dandruff. Gross! Am I eating that? This teen wonders why it isn't named Ice Hat. <laughs> Where's your hat? Family making a ruckus. Just gonna check. Okay. Right. It's snowing dandruff. Uh, uh, if I steal its hat. Okay. Envious, too bad! Oh my. Copyright infringement, those are clearly Mario things. Article of clothing, I wonder why. What happens if I steal it? You're trying to steal Ice Cap's hat, but it is not weakened enough. Oh, okay. Help, fashion police! Oh, fashion police, I need help! Also wants a hat for its nose. Alright. No, I don't, I don't, I don't, if I ignore it. You manage to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. What? What are you doing? What? What are you doing? That could be, uh, Ice Cap is secretly checking if you're looking at his hat. I'm just gonna know. You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. It seems defeated. Fine, I don't care. 
Uh. Ice Cap is better for attention. Compliment. You inform Ice Cap that it has a great hat. Let me guess, I just screwed that up, didn't I? I was just supposed to keep ignoring me. You won! You won 0 XP and 13 gold. Awesome! There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this? You and you ponder. I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, it's not yet a very famous royal guardsman. <laughs> oh, there's a thing going behind it. Can I... Oh, I can't poke my head through it. Absolutely no moving! Okay. Eh. Oh dear. It's a dog. Did something move? Was it my imagination? I could only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Doggo blocks the way. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. What happens if I do move? Oh, okay. <laughs> Doggo can't seem to find anything. Squirrels. Will it move this time? Doggo can't seem to find anything. You pet dogger. <laughs> one, one, now, one, now, one, now, wow, wow, wow. What? I've been pet! Pat, 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 pat. <laughs> dogger has been pet. You won. You won 0 XP and 30 gold. S -s -s Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Dog treats. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Oh. 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 Dog treats is a drug. Oh, and it looks like a bow if I'm... Yay! I have a dog bow. <laughs> okay. Hey look, it's Sans again. Hey. Here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop sign's red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! North, ice, south, ice, west, ice, east, Snowden Town. And ice. Awesome! Lesser dog appears. Hello, doggy. <laughs> Check pet, 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 pet. I'll choose the fifth pet. You barely lifted your hand and Lesser Dog got excited. <laughs> oh! <laughs> lesser Dog is barking excitedly. You won! You won 0 XP and 0 gold. Whoa! 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 Okay, that's enough of that. Uh, let's head east to get to Snowden Town and Ice. Wait. How are you in two places at once? I don't see you moving. What? Okay. Ah, so Sans is a mystical creature, is he? You're so lazy! You were napping all night! I think that's called... sleeping. Excuses, excuses! <gasps> oh no! Oh, ho ho! The human arrives! In order to stop you, my brother and I have crafted some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking! 
for you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of the maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sounds like fun, because the amount of fun you will have probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. <laughs> Sans, what did you do that for? I think the human is, has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Incredible! You slippery snail! You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother Sans. You'll be surely confounded. I know I am. <laughs> I have to make sure I get the right amount of hehehehe in the nyehehehehe. There's fours exactly. But did he moonwalk out? I just saw it out of the corner of my vision. He was facing to the left. Hey, Sans. How's it going? Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? He made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? He is. Oh, dude, that dude's just like a cool, 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 cool as a cucumber. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello. I thought I had like a thousand and one hundred and sixteen sixty gold. That's wrong. Would you like some ice cream? Hello. Would you like some ice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just fifteen gold. Sure. Here you go. Have a super duper day. You got the nice cream. Yay. A snowball. Oh my god. Yes. 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 <laughs> Excuse me while I, be, while I get distracted. Oh, okay. Hey. You. You're important. I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just five gold. Sure. Did I say five gold? I meant fifty gold. Sure. Really? How about 5,000 gold? Sure. 50,000 gold, that's my final offer. Sure. What? You don't have the money. Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, why is the ball back? Sans, did you do something to the ball? You have your wibbly wobbly mind bending teleportation powers affixed to the ball. Come back. I'm not good at this snow sock business. Son of a bitch. Let me guess, this is Snow Golf, and I'm currently rocking a bogey 600. Alright. <laughs> the mythical bogey 600. Known only to the worst players of Snow Golf. Oh, it is Snow Golf. Yeah! Even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achie achieved the end of ball. You were awarded 2G. Yay! This flag has nothing else to offer. Nyeh! Okay. Nyeh! Oh, I can do it again! Get another 2G! Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna be master at ice golf soon. Hey! Blue. Hopping and twirling, your original style has pulled you through. You are awarded 2G. Yay! A small snowball. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. Okay. <laughs> it's a snow decahedron. Ten sides. Amazing. Oh, hello. Human, I hope you're ready for. <gasps> Sans, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Um... Okay, so... Sans! That didn't do anything! Whoops. 
I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that! In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude, that is easy peasy word scramble. That's for baby bones. Uh, unbelievable. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder, Jumble, crossword? You two are weird! Crosswords are so easy! It's the same solution every time! I just fill all the boxes with the letter Z, because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. Yeah. <laughs> Papyrus finds difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday you got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. <laughs> It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy this spaghetti. It'll do no. This spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed again by the great Papyrus. Japed? Yeah, <laughs> Papyrus. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so apparently I've been playing this for an additional 30 minutes, so I think the spaghetti is a good place to... It's an unplugged microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> it's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. <laughs> you mean like the cheese? Hey, the mouse. Anyway. <laughs> so I think the frozen spaghetti is a good place to end this playthrough uh, part. Um, so yeah, that, that that was Undertale, the second part. Um, really funny so far. I'm enjoying this game. I can understand why there's a massive following behind it. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, I hope you didn't get too annoyed by my voices of Papyrus and Sans. Um, but yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, uh, uh, mm, uh, uh, mm. Anyway. So this is Kyo and I signing off for this. Let's this this part. <sighs> so yeah, this is Kyo and I signing off for this part, and I thank you for watching this. This is Kyo and I signing off. Goodbye and good luck. I said that like three times. That's too many times.